Thank you for using SparkPost. In this short video, I'm going to give you a quick overview of how to create an API key and send email with the Java API. Hey, let's get started. You can find information about how to use the Java library in GitHub. In your own project, just include this Maven stanza in your POM file. This is a snippet of code that demonstrates how to send an email with the text part and an HTML part. We will start by opening a terminal window and cloning the project from GitHub. Type git, clone, and the URL from GitHub. Once the project is finished being cloned, type maven, clean, install. This will build the Spark Post library and all the samples. Once the project has finished building, open Eclipse. Select Menu, File, Import, Maven, Existing Maven Project. Now select the directory where you built the project in Maven. Eclipse will process the project and after a few seconds it'll be ready. Let's take a quick look at the sample we're going to build. It's in com, spark post, sparkpost.java here. In the source code, we have a placeholder for the API key. Let's go create the API key on the sparkpost.com website. Select account, select the new API key button. Now let's select all permissions and give it a name. Now select the Add API Key button. Select the API key and copy it to your clipboard. In Eclipse, we'll paste our API key to the place where it says your API key here. Now we'll set the sender's address. Who we're sending to. and we'll change the HTML part to uh, some text that we'll recognize. Run the sample, and go to your mail client to see the email was delivered. With a few lines of code, you can start sending email from any of your Java applications.